Hi everybody, I'm Julie Eau Claire and you're watching Parents TV. It is every parent's worst nightmare, sudden infant death syndrome, and it kills more babies aged one month to one year than any other illness. SID strikes with no warning. There's no cause and no cure, but there are things you can do to reduce the risk for your baby. Parents TV's Katie Zachary shows us the measures keeping more babies alive. There are no symptoms or signs. No way parents can know their baby will never wake up. Losing a child profoundly changed who I was and really fundamentally changed what was important in my life. Allison Rhodes lost her first son, Connor, to SIDS. It does not discriminate, and, and that's the thing. It can happen to anyone at any time. Sudden infant death syndrome occurs when a healthy baby unexpectedly dies, and doctors cannot find a medical reason behind it. It claims the lives of thousands of infants every year and turns parents like Rhodes into mission-driven moms. Not the side, not the stomach, back to sleep is best. SIDS is often called crib death. Research shows putting babies under a year old on their back to sleep greatly reduces their risk for SIDS. There are more boys who fall victim than girls and more SIDS deaths are reported in the fall and winter months, possibly because of overheating. Experts say keep stuffed animals out of the crib when the baby's sleeping and never overbundle your baby or keep the room too hot. Rose and her husband Kenny say they follow these rules as closely with each of their next three children as they did with Connor. Is that your bunny? Where's your bunny? Where's your bunny? She knows there's nothing she could have done to save Connor, and she tries to tell other Sid's parents that. The couple now runs a baby-proofing business. They educate parents in New York and Connecticut about the dangers children face at home, from infant to much older. This is, I mean, this is more than a job. This is our passion, and we needed to do this. This was our calling. For Parents TV, I'm Katie Zachary. The National Institute of Child Health and Human Development sponsors the Back to Sleep campaign, which encourages parents of healthy babies to put them to sleep on their backs. Since the campaign began in the mid-90s, the number of SIDS babies has been cut in half. Thanks for watching Parents TV, your source for the best information for your growing family. Thank you for watching Parents TV, our families, our lives.